Welcome back, J Squad. So I have another swimsuit video, and specifically, Zaffle swimsuits. I have worked with them in the past. I do love their swimsuits, but do these fit? Are these worth it? They have some new ones up there that I haven't tried, and guess what? I'm pretty sure a majority of them are bikinis. And even though I'm as bloated as a cow today, we're still going to try them on. So let's get started because if you follow me on Snapchat and Instagram, you've already seen a sneak peek of what's in this lovely bag that I just showed you. So if you're not already following me, follow me up there where I post the behind the scenes for my photo shoots that I do. And I ask you guys questions about outfits, videos, and you guys know when upcoming videos are. So uh, if you're not part of the J Squat family, what the f*** are you doing? So follow me on my social media, subscribe here, give this video a thumbs up because you have opposable thumbs, so put it to use and let's jump into the video. So the first swimsuit is something that I actually did a photo shoot in yesterday and hopefully by the time this video is posted I could post like a sneak peek of it. I mean I have some sneak peeks of the proofs from the camera on my phone so I might pop it up somewhere around here, but if not, then I guess you should have followed me on Snapchat so you could have seen exactly what this looks like. But it's this vibrant blue swimsuit and it has the extra strings attached to it that kind of like go up. And I like these because they really flatter your body. They make your legs look so long when you have an extra string that like kind of V's up on your, your stomach. And then it's this mesh top. Triangle tops don't really fit my boobs because they're so big, but I don't mind boob spillage because, I mean, they're boobs. Get over it. So it has this mesh on the at the top and mesh on the bottom, and your nipples are supposed to be hidden behind this. Surprisingly, my nipples actually are hidden behind this because I have the hugest areolas ever. So um, I'm surprised that my pepperonis can, uh, you know, actually be hidden behind this. So. I like it. It's a size medium, and I don't know how much it was, but I'll put the price somewhere on the screen. For this bathing suit, I'll say that it runs a tad bit small. Um, I am a small in American sizes, but this is a size medium. It still looks good on me. I can get away with it, but as you can see, I have boobies, spillage. That's why I say what I say. This is a size medium, and I'm a 34D, so do with that information that you would. For style, I'll give it a five. For fit, I'll give it a two and a half to three, just because I can get into it, but the sizing seems a little bit small. And for quality, I give it a five, so I'd wear it again. The next one suit is this white one, and the top seems kind of big. It's a medium. I kind of like the bottoms. I think the bottoms are the only thing that I actually like for this swimsuit and it's making my camera dark because it's white. Um, again, it's this uh, extra strap that kind of flatters your body. I'm not too crazy about this one, but I don't, again, I'll put the price up here. This was a size medium. I'm not really liking the way this swimsuit looks on my body. I don't like the top at all. This is a size medium. The bottoms are cute, but it does like this bulging thing right here bottoms are okay the top just is too plain for me so material i'll give it a five it's actually not swimsuit material i wouldn't even like know what type of material this is maybe just regular cotton um fit i would give this is a size medium so it's an asian medium so i'll give it a three you should always keep in mind that Asian sizes are small i weigh 115 pounds so it should tell you something this is quite fit it on me. It's not like too tight, but it's fitted. Um, quality, I'll give it a five. Would I wear it again? Probably not. So I kind of got three bathing suits in three different colors because yellow, that's why. So I got the same one that was in the blue color in pink, and I got this in a medium. It's a hot pink. I don't typically like wearing hot pink. I don't know why. I think it looks good on girls on like my skin tone for like other girls, but for some reason it's just weird seeing me in it. I guess I feel like a highlighter walking around and when you're a highlighter, it highlights everything on your body that you don't like. But it's still cute and it fits extra string. I do really like it and the top looks the same as, you know, the blue one. Not much different, but 
I don't know, I probably won't wear this one as much as I wear the blue one because, I don't know, I feel like a traffic cone, even though traffic cones are orange. Mmm. I feel... I feel... Girl, I don't know what I feel, but, you know, it's cute. Sticking to the theme, I got the black one in the same bathing suit. Now, I didn't actually know what would fit my body, so I kind of decided, what if a medium doesn't fit? So let's get the black one in a large and see how that fits. It's too big. Too big. I did a photo shoot in the large bottoms, and they were okay fitting. It's just that this string just kept flapping down, and you'll see in some of the photos um, that I'll post right here, because I have some of the proofs of the photo shoot. Again, you guys would have saw the Snapchat behind the scenes if you're not following me follow me so yeah these are kind of big so I'm gonna wash them and I don't know maybe give it to someone um, the top though I think actually it's too big too. like the straps are just too big but I don't know I'll try it on again to see if I'm right but I really don't think I can fit this which is so sad cuz it's so cute on. So the next one is this burgundy color. And I really like the bottoms. So again, I'm a creature of habit. I'm a basic bitch. When I like something, I get the style in different colors and different designs. So it's the same design that it has the extra strap going up, but it doesn't go up as high as the other one. And it has this mesh on the middle. I really like this bottom, don't know how often I'll wear it, but it's cute, right? The top is just as cute, it's just, and it has the mesh around it, but there's no support at all to this. Like, look how big this is. This isn't a size medium, and the top just fits like a size large. Like, my boobs are big, but they ain't this big. Like, if you have big boobs, you need support, baby, and this, this ain't supporting Barack Obama's election to get back into the White House after Trump. It ain't gonna support nothing. The quality, I would give it a two because there's like no support whatsoever for this. And I don't know, just this top just seems big even though it's a size medium. Um, style is cute. I'll give it like a four. And fit, I'd give it a two and a half. Would I wear this again? No. So I think I got two one pieces from there and it was this green one. You guys know, I saw, I put this on Snapchat as a sneak peek to this video, but there's like no support at all. Usually one pieces are so tight and have so much support. It's tight at the bottom, but the top is so loose. Like this is so flimsy. I usually don't ever have a problem with one pieces. But this just wasn't doing it. My boobs are not held in. I need support. My boobs are 34D. They need something to hold them bags of jelly up. This just isn't doing it. Such a cute swimsuit though. It has, you know, the lining right here, the, you know, the straps and stuff. But again, I might have to give it to someone. Fit is like well fitted down here, but the top is really, really flimsy. Like it's yeah, no good. Like my boob is coming out, but it's not coming out in the way that it's supported. Like other bathing suits like this that I wear, where my boobs are out, they're really, really supportive. Like I could have a nip slip. I would give this a one and a half. I'll give it a one and a half. Um, for style, I'll give it a four because this is the type of style that I like. And for quality though, I would give this a one just because like this, this is really flimsy, you guys. Like super super flimsy there's there's a cup in here but it just gives no support I wear it again now the next swimsuit is really weird again it was a sneak peek on snapchat so it's like all these straps it's a really weird pukey diarrhea color and I knew it was this diarrhea type of color online but when you see it like face to face it's I don't like it I don't like the color at all but it's this really strappy one and it's just weird. I got this in a size large. The top, you'll see when I try it on, girl. Like this, I'm donating or giving it away. It, it just, you'll see, you'll see. This bathing suit is just a mess. I like the way the bottoms fit. I love the way they look. I don't like the color. The top is, what? what is going on? 
on here? Boob spillage over. Like, it looks like it's not even on me correctly. I hate the color. Like, I don't like it. So quality, it is pretty flimsy. So I would give this like a two. Uh, fit is really bad. These fit kind of loose, but this is kind of tight and just, oh, it just doesn't look good. I would give this like a one. Um, and style, uh, it was cute online, but in person. So style, I would have to give it a one. Would I wear it again? No, this is like, a hot damn mess like this is a mess got another blue bathing suit i love the color blue but it's different you know it's different so it's okay it's different but the same so it has the extra strap like the other blue one but it's like really cool looking inside out though so it has the extra strap that goes up your belly oh yeah yeah yes you're gonna see it when i try it on it's not cooperating pop is what makes it a little different is why why are you giving me a headache why what are you doing cooperate okay so it has like these straps i mean the the cups have like this extra strap going around it to like outline it and that is so adorable to me when i got this in a size large and i would have to say that it fits like a medium so this is a large and it definitely almost fits like a like an american small so be careful i'm a size small in america and this is a size large in china websites so if you're any bit bigger than me then you probably should pass on this it's really nice on my body though i really like it for fit i'll give it a one and a half for style i'll give it a five for material i'll give it a five just sizing is just a no-go. Next bathing suit is white. I have been on this love of white recently. Like I've gotten a white skirt, a white dress, and like four white bathing suits recently. Like I'm loving white. And it is this bathing suit right here. I really can't remember if it fits. So you guys are gonna, me and you gonna be just as surprised when I try it on. So it's like this, I have been seeing this for years online. I just thought it was like, I already have this in beige that I got from Forever 21. So it, in the back is where the strap, the straps are. It's not really, maybe it is on the side, I don't know. But these strings look really long. I have to see if this fits again, but it's, all these are really good quality bathing suits. Like, I'm not mad at the quality of this. Like, it has this little ruching right here. So we'll see if this fits on. You guys be the tell. This was a size medium. I feel like I would like this bathing suit if it fit. This is a size medium and it fits like a size large. There's no support. The strings are way too long to give you any type of support like a normal like uh, one piece would give you. I love the size. I love the way it looks. It's just sizing is kind of big. So quality, I give it a five. Style, I'll give it a five. Sizing, I'll give it a true to size so maybe a five because i'm actual i'm an actually small in american sizes so this is actually true to size it's not an asian size in my opinion so yeah i mean i guess it's a good rating it's just not for me because it doesn't finally the last bathing suit is this gray bathing suit and this one's the most plainest one that i've gotten and i think it's just too plain for me to love it but it's wow why are you there we go it's just this normal it would think you would think that it'd be high-waisted a little bit but it's just i don't know it's just too plain for me and this is a size large and i would have to say that i think it fits like a medium but it's just so plain and i don't like plain i don't know what possessed me to get it i don't know it's just really plain i might have to give this one you know away because we ain't no basic bitch, okay you know so i don't have any makeup on right now because it's like the next day that i'm trying on swimsuits again and i'm sitting on the floor so that you can see me at this angle but how i feel about zaffle is that i do like their swimsuits they do have good quality it's just finding a swimsuit that fits your body and i did choose some swimsuits that aren't what i typically wear and i passed on them just because they're not my style that doesn't mean as you guys can see from the rating they're not bad swimsuits it's just not my style like it was either just boring for me or, I don't know, it's just, 
It looked kind of childish to me, but that doesn't mean that it wasn't a good swimsuit. So I just wanted to come up in here and say that. So please excuse the makeup, the no makeup face. I literally just rolled out of bed. So mm, I'll talk to you guys later. Let's go back to past Jasmine because this is the next day. So take it away past Jasmine. So that is my haul on Zaful. I 100% trust their, um, their bathing suits. If you were to ever buy anything, that I, I would buy their bathing suits. Also, they are doing a back to school um, sale. I believe things might be 50% off. I could be wrong. I'll put up the details on the screen somewhere. But, you know, do think about shopping back to school. Just keep in mind that this is coming from China, so it may take a few weeks to get to you on more average. It, 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 would, it usually takes longer than most shipping. So just keep that in mind. They do have really great sales and really great prices. Just make sure that you look at the things that have been reviewed if you don't trust it. And just go on um, YouTube. When I watch a little bit of YouTube for Zaffo, I don't really see too many bad reviews. So I have worked with them in the past. I haven't really been too disappointed. So thumbs up. So give this video a thumbs up, you guys, if you enjoyed it. Follow me on Snapchat and Instagram like I haven't already shamelessly plugged that like a hundred times in this video. And I will talk to you guys later. See you later, J-Squad.